I'll be on some other shit It's kinda bittersweet that I fell in love with it I always felt that if I always cared about how I dress That folks would think I'm arrogant and chicks would lose interest But as it turns out, people start to notice you more You turn heads when you step and foot in them sneaker stores Like where you get them, can I get them, what's the biggest size left And chicks that never would have seen What's up everybody? It's Big Roth TV and I'm back with another sneaker video, all right? Now I won't waste your time. Let's go ahead and bring this box out. Boom, boom, won't show my address, but as you can see, this comes from the good folks over at Nike. We are offsetting 100% of the carbon emissions for this shipment, all right? I already opened them. Let's get this out the way. Boom. And as you can see, Nike SB box. All right. Nike SB box. That purple and white. All right. Now, these are the Nike SB Zoom Blazer Mid Edge. All right. Colorway, Team Red, Navy, and Light Dew. All right. I go size 13 in these bad boys. And the retail for these was $95. All right. Now, I got to tell you, for that price... For that price and for the quality of this shoe, because I've already looked at them, but for the quality, 95 is a steal. I even got it for a little bit less, but $95 for this, man. Let's go ahead and get into it, man. But of course, of course, you all know how I do it right here on Big Rob TV. <sighs> the quality, man. <sighs> Left shoe first, baby. Oh, let me get a little closer. Look at the quality. Look at the leather quality. Yo, I'm not even lying to you. It's, it looks a little more red on camera. It looks a little bit more red on camera to me. But man, look at the... Is there a shoe tree in there? Let me take this paper out of here so y'all can really feel me. Because I don't think y'all feel me right now when I tell you the quality of this shoe <sighs> look at that man look at the soft look how i touched the look at the softness of that leather man all around all around the shoe that leather quality man this is some of the softest leather quality I've seen on a sneaker recently. This is $95. This is 95 bucks, man. And if, if you're a student or you're in the military, you can get this for less. But this is $95. We pay more for Jordans with less quality than this. Like... 95 bucks now i know this colorway may not be everybody's thing right but the quality of the shoe is man it's ridiculous this is ridiculous all right now when you think about these shoes these are a nike blazer mid edge right nike sb blazer mid edge this is in the same vein as this shoe all right this is one of the previous blazer mid edge the sbs this is one of my favorite colorways actually boom and you see that double tongue 
This is one of the original ones that they did last year. Very dope as well. But this has that canvas kind of material on here. For this new one, they switched it up with that leather. So when I saw these, I said, okay, I'm familiar. I'm familiar with what we what we doing here with this style of shoe. You know, with the cutout swoosh going around here on one side. And then on the inside, you have the actual blue swoosh there. I like what they're doing with that. And what they also did here is the, the swoosh that's removed here. They moved it down here to the toe box area. So that's very dope. But they also left that stitching of where the swoosh is supposed to be. All right, man, the more I, I just keep looking at this leather and the color, the colorway of the shoe. And I'm like, there's a school, there's a high school somewhere missing some pigskin. They ain't got no football. And they just out there like, where's our football? Yeah, the, the leather quality went here. It went, it went on this shoe. Nike said, give us that. Them kids don't need no footballs. That's what they said. Man, it's so soft. They did their damn thing on this one. I like that little bit of suede. That's also what the what the uh, the swooshes are, that suede. It's not quite the nappiest of suede. This brown, this, this tan part is kind of that nappy. But the blue suede isn't as as nappy as as the other as the tan white laces straight white laces all right this is that football leather right here let me unlace it a little bit boom and let's get on up in here again that's one thing i don't like much about blazers is that they come yoked up super tight and you got to really get them unlaced so that your foot can even fit in there. But let's get that tongue out so you can see the double tongue here. Bring it closer for you all. There's that gold tongue with that Nike SB Dunk Low Pro tongue. This is the Dunk Low Pro tongue here, the gold one. And then the high one, the, the blue one, is that blazer mid edge nike sb all right kind of a kind of a light teal you know what i'm saying very dope man very dope colorway on the inside nike sb zoom air nike sb zoom air and you have that that blue insole with the gold leathering all right very nice very nice nice and soft around here these are gonna be comfortable at least for me i know i love blazers so nice padding around here so it's gonna have some good support you can see it's really thick padding there so it's not it's not like the old school chuck taylors i know people look at blazers and chucks and stuff like that and they just see from back in the day how those shoes used to fit. And you're like, man, I'll never wear those. But these are not those. Even Chuck Taylors are not the same. If you get the Chuck 70s or if you were able to find back in, a few years ago the, the Chuck Taylor 2s, those are not the same Chucks from before. Like, the materials are different now. These can be worn all day with some comfort. I know the feeling of the old school chucks. I know the feeling. They used to kill my feet. But I can wear some Chuck 70s or Chuck 2s all day long. All day long, maximum comfort. And I feel like that's what blazers are like. All right. Nice, thick midsole here. All white. All white. And somehow, that doesn't get that dirty. It is that all white midsole here, but it doesn't get as dirty as you would think when you rock them. All right, boom gum bottoms on these bad boys. Man, definitely dope, man. Whew, these joints is hard, man. And they, they're still available. Golly, I just accidentally touched, I just accidentally touched right there and it's just so soft. It's just so soft, man. These joints are still available. 
they released with a all black pair as well that has kind of a, a darker gray swoosh instead of this blue it's an all black one i wasn't able to get that one that one went pretty fast in my size but this one definitely dope man i would recommend recommend you go ahead and get in one of these if you are into blazers i know blazers are not for everybody i know everybody doesn't like this shoe but if you are digging them go ahead and get you some man in case you are on the fence or thinking about going ahead and picking up a pair of these blazers for me personally i go down half a size i'm a true 13 and a half but i go down to a 13 in blazers because just like chuck taylor's or vans or something to that nature blazers run a little long so for me perfect fit would be a 13 in these so that's what i would recommend go half size down white nike lettering on the back i don't know if i mentioned that before and real quick the right shoe has the alternate laces now it comes with that team red colorway of the laces that kind of match the actual quality of the leather i don't know i think i'm gonna stick with the white but you do have that option and that's a good good thick good thick quality lace too that's a good quality shoe lace right there is there another one in there is there another one nope just the just the white and the red so if you wanted to switch it up throw the, the red ones in there you do have that option it was in the right shoe definitely dope man definitely a dope shoe this is this is one of the only shoes i've bought so far this year one of two one of two so far so uh i have another one coming next week but i had to have these joints all right but that's going to do it for this one. Thumbs up if you like this video. Subscribe if you have not already. Thank you all for watching. Thank you all for subscribing. I truly, truly appreciate it. More content is on the way. And I'll holler at you all in the next video. Peace.